Can you see what black women have done, dog? Yeah, but it's, it's... because because his wife was so jealous of him that she wanted to destroy him from the inside. He said, "You can be the biggest movie star. You can do whatever. Me now, I'm gonna fuck some guy who doesn't know whether he's gay or not. Yeah. I'm gonna fuck August Alsina. That's what I'll do. When I yes, you're the Oscar-winning, Grammy Award-winning movie star. Everything. You know what I'm gonna do to show you that you ain't shit. I'm just gonna fuck some unknown, fallen off R&B star. And that pierces through so the heart, of course. Fana, Fana, you saw. <laughs> Will Smith, Vanna Faye, you, say, you saw how, what that woman did to that man. <laughs> Family man, so, wow. But you know, you know what that man said? I'm not going to let you see me suffer. Yeah. But it took him a while. Be but it took him a while. Uh -uh. He continued, dog. He's still making movies, dog. He's still doing his thing. Yes, right. Yeah, now Jada is now trying to do. She's producing a new series on Netflix, whatever. But nobody wants to watch that shit. We're not gonna watch a series produced by a woman who destroyed her man. No, who but destroyed you... a black man who is the reason why we have positive role models for black boys right now. Yeah. Will Smith is a positive role yes, model, bro. and he's he always been dog. And do you know how much discipline it took for him to maintain that? But he was crushed, bruh. For, for some point, for some time, yeah, nara. By whom? Ah, uh, ish. Um, kawati like the uh, inclusive, bro. Like, uh, I. By black women. I've been women. through such a similar By situation, so like, hey. Black women, and you know what? Naga feet, no feet. So we're talking now. We end our life. Yeah, bon. Live, bro. Live, bro. Soon. And now we're talking about Jada. Soon, bro. Jada, what you did was wrong, dog. What you did was wrong. So now we've been desensitized to it. Yeah, we've been so desensitized to it that dog. If your mother, and for you, the feminist, dude. There's, there, there's black men that have lost their jobs because they cheated. Show me one black woman that lost her job because she cheated. Well, that's how they look for their jobs. Some of them, not all. <laughs> huh? <laughs> huh? That's how they secure their jobs. Bro, your platform, I'm scared to raise my point. Like, like with you, like this, you just speak freely like you. I wish to do that, but hey, man. On your platform, mate. The people are always coming for you. Uh, I mean, I'm not ready to be. No, 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 no. Never. Then you are coming here to spread evil thoughts. Why would you say people are always coming for me? Who has ever come for me? Who can come for me? Show me. No, I'm just saying in terms of like. Come can come for me. So therefore, you've got nothing to fear, dog. Sure. I'm talking to you. I'm still alive. My phone is on. Yeah. They've got, they, I, I've given you no evidence that you've got anything to fear. Yeah, yeah. I've given you all the evidence that you can say whatever you want so, so you saying such things you're putting it out there into the into the ether that no there's something to fear around me there's nothing to fear around me there's nothing to fear, fear. true no. Yeah, no. Stop saying that why would you say that don't say sure. that don't oh. put it out there don't say this don't put that energy there say oh. what you want to say and just say it i'm saying that no woman the point that you made you know, no woman you know, has ever been chased away from work for cheating. I'm saying that's how some of them look for jobs in the first place. Exactly. As they see you. Exactly. You know what I mean? And, and what does that? It goes down. To, power. And what does that? They are allowed to use their sexual power. Wait, wait, wait. They are allowed to use their sexual power to get ahead. So a woman is allowed to. If she's young, she's 24 years old, she goes to a company, she offers her body to some guy who can get her ahead. As soon as it's found out, yeah. she then says no, it was sexual harassment. But her intention in giving her body to this person was that she's going to use her body to get ahead. The crime that she's using her body to get ahead is not punished. But the person who is victim to her criminality is the one that's punished. Yeah.
and then it's building a you culture can't now. Oh. You can't tell me that you, you can't. No, you can. I can. Don't stop saying you can't say anything. We can say whatever we want, man. Stop saying no, you I'm can't saying say that stop has saying. built a culture. No, don't say that. Don't say what I'm saying is that when you say that, you give that power. Do not give that power. Do not say that. Say what you feel. The, yeah, I'm saying. It's not. It's not. It, hold on. The problem is not being unable to say what you feel. The problem is thinking that you will be punished for saying what you feel. What I'm trying to say yeah. to you is that it's only punishment if you feel it is punishment. So sure. if the consequences of your actions are not seen to you as punishment, then mm -hmm. you're not being punished. Correct. Do you understand what I'm saying? Correct. That, then you're not so, being punished. So adding to your point that you are so saying about if, women. If you know how to survive a bomb blast. Yeah. Then a bomb is useless. Correct. One hundred. You then you know how to survive a bomb blast. Then a bomb is useless. You don't need to know how to detonate a bomb yeah. if you know how to survive a bomb blast. Correct. So I was just adding on to your point, saying if we, women are adding their bodies as they see me, that has now built a culture that, that is now it's expected for all these young women that are coming into Every whatever industry that they. Every girl that's on Instagram, that's an Instagram model. Her body is her CV. Because that, what are you selling? You're yeah. selling your body. Go on. That's what you're selling. Yeah. You're selling your body. You understand? Mm -hmm. and, you're, and, 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 and if you look at like the bikini design, the design of bikinis, women's bikinis these days. Women's bikinis is going to become a G-string in the front. The way they designed whoa, it. Whoa, whoa, okay. Because it used to cover the front of the groin. Yeah. Now it only covers the slit of the vagina. Yeah. You can and, see and the, the bras side. also are like that. The bras are like that now. But the bras, it doesn't matter really. Because it's not like, you know, a boobs or private parts. Nipples, <laughs> since bus coverage, they're not, they're not private parts. They're not private parts. Yeah. They're not private parts. Boobs and nipples are not private parts. If a woman whips up her, her nipple and uh, best feeds her baby, it's it's absolutely acceptable. It's absolutely normal. But they try to even cancel that. They, they're trying to no, cancel that. They didn't cancel. No, but you see, that's the thing. Don't use misinformation and then say things. They never try. They say they're allowing the showing of nude breasts now only by transgenders, which means that women have given up their gender. They don't know, there's no such thing as a woman anymore. Women do not exist. Yeah. There's no such thing as a woman anymore. Because women said, we do not exist. Anyone can identify as a woman and they can become a woman. There you go. I get the thing how you are born. Right now, by the taboo, let look press you don't in public. Like they see that something you know that's disgusting no later. Do you know why no one wants to become a man? Yeah. Because if you become a man, you have to fight like a man. Correct. You understand what I'm saying? Sure. If, if you become a man, you have to fight like a man. Sure. You understand? Mm. Once we get, uh, once we come mano imano, it's mano imano. <laughs> yeah. They don't want that. They don't want that. So wh what would they rather do? Oh, women are perpetual victims. Oh, women can't be touched. Women get away with everything. Let us become women so we can take advantage of being women. And then what do oh. stupid women do? They fight for those rights. They, yes, we want those rights. Yes. We want those rights. It's not about the head of the household. It's about if there's Bullets coming for the household. Are you standing in front of those bullets? Yes or no? If you're unprepared to stand in front of those bullets, you are unprepared to leave the household. <laughs> if when an intruder comes into the house, you are the last line of defense or the first line of defense, yeah. then you can leave the household. Failing which, you cannot leave the household. You cannot it. protect the household. You think with the ship. You cannot protect the household. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. If you cannot protect the household, you cannot lead the household. You cannot defend the household, you cannot lead the household. Mm -hmm. Why? Because everything that's valuable inside the household 
When a man comes there with a gun and he finds a woman, the woman tries to run away. The man says, I've worked hard for everything that's inside this yeah. house. I will fight for, I will defend my property. I worked hard for my property. You understand? Uh, yeah. I've worked hard for this property. You're not going to take this property off of me easily. Blood, sweat, and tears went into acquiring this property. If you want to take it off me, blood must be spilt. Yeah. I think, yes. Simple, okay. simple and plain. Yeah. Uh, correct. So, so what, can I ask, what's your, what's your... So, so the feminists, hold on, wait, I'm getting to a point. Yeah. So the feminists are the feminists are the feminists. The biggest feminists. Who is their god? Who is their queen? The mastermind. No, who's their queen right now? Who's their icon, the idols of black women? Who's their queen? Angaz. Beyonce. Beyonce, I feel the like, biggest I feel like... Beyonce, the biggest feminist, is married to a Ish. rapper. Ish. Associated with misogyny and all that shit. Number two, other than her being married, she went to perform in Saudi Arabia yesterday. Yeah. In Saudi Arabia, women are not allowed to drive cars, unaccompanied, all of those things. Mm. So now you're telling me that when it's time to make money, Beyonce is, yes, feminism, feminism, yeah. feminism, feminism, feminism. But when she goes home, she's, she puts away the feminism. She becomes... Uh, when it's time to protest, when it's time to protest and say, oh, these countries, Iran, Oh, you guys are abusing women. Oh, let's post a post. Oh, they are slaughtering people. Yes, but when $24 million is offered to you, you go and fly and you do a performance in, in, in Saudi Arabia where you are able to dress and do whatever you want. But the women who live there, once you leave, if they do, if they do what you do, they have their heads chopped off. Mm. Mm. Yeah, Beyonce yeah. is doing things that would get other women's hair chopped off in the same country where they are paying her to perform. She's yeah. endorsing those countries. She can never say anything bad about Saudi Arabia because she accepted that $24 million to go and perform there. Did she need it? Saudi is Arabia, it about the money? Saudi Arabia, 